Hello everybody, my name is Dizzy and welcome back to what is already a late stream and will very probably be a short stream. Uh, we're going to be doing some Paleopines and I am <laughs> absolutely emotionally shattered. Uh, today it's just been... It's just been a ride this whole week. It's been... <laughs> it's been a lot. And I'm not going to go into to details of, of why and stuff. Um, but suffice to say, Paleo Pines a day, and it's in the title, but I do not currently know when I'm next going to be streaming, because I wasn't really super feeling like streaming today. And I was like, well, i got to do something with my afternoon, so I'll stream. Uh, but tomorrow is not looking likely. Friday is not looking likely. Next week, goodness only knows. Uh, I will hope to be around at the very least for... Let's uh, get some things on the screen. On the screen. I hope to be around at the very least for uh, Baldur's Gate, the Shaka. Um, but that is, that is about it <laughs> in terms of what I feel like I am. Um, capable of committing to right now. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's been a day. It will, I'm sure, continue being a day. <laughs> uh, but for now, let's jump right in uh, and see what we're doing with, with them dinos, because uh, last time we came super duper close. Nope, not that button. This button. We came super duper close to this to finding all of the ancient tablets we have one fragment left to find <laughs> it's really quite distressing because i have absolutely no idea where it is i actually have no idea where any of the remaining collectibles could possibly be uh there's like a few of them there's still two of these fragments two of these fragments uh two of these fragments somewhere around goodness only knows where who knows what these two things are um because <laughs> I feel like I've been all over this map many times, but uh, that's by the by. Let's head to bed uh, and we will go all around and say hi to everyone. If we're lucky, it'll be... No, it's not raining. Big sad. Rain is obviously the best weather. Um, Alright, let's have a look. Eight! Oh my god, eight whole dinos need attention. Uh, for one thing. Actually, I'm gonna stand here because I need to get someone out. Because it's Marlo's birthday today. He will want some food. Shall we give him this blueberry jam? That sounds like a thing Marlo would like. I've got these corn seeds. I don't quite know why I have these corn seeds. I'm sure it's fine that I have these corn seeds. I'm sure I have them for a good reason. Uh. <laughs> Um, bu -bu 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 -bu. right, journal. Uh, some crops and weedings, the things ready to harvest, and okay, so Lucky's pen needs a clean, Trance Wright's pen needs a clean, uh, and Stereochromis' pen needs a clean. Oh my god, we are gonna have so much fertilizer at the end of today, my goodness. Let's get our shovels going. Say hi to Trans Rights. Hi, Trans Rights. Strictly speaking, I don't think I need to go around and say hi to everyone every day, but like, I'm not a monster. You know? I'm not gonna not say hi to everyone. Uh, we have Salty. Hi there. Was it your pen who also needed a clean? I wish it didn't collapse these all every time I, I close the journal. No, it's Lucky and Stereochromis who need thing. Uh, I don't know if you're coming with us today, Salty, but we'll we'll bring you over just in case. Say hi to Species. Uh, let's say, not you. Say hi to Lucky. Lucky, our first dinosaur, the Parasaurolophus, whose friends and family we are currently trying to find. Geshi is here. EJ is here. Hi. Let's get the shovel out. Uh, is that it? 
No, there's one, one other one here, hiding in some tall grass. Species! <laughs> there we go. Alright. You're all good. Uh, you can follow. So we're gonna need you. Bup. Alright, you guys also need a clean. Say hi to stay Chromas. You guys obviously need another bit of a clean. Say hi to Artie. Artie you can come with. Uh you still need a clean? I can't see anything. <laughs> Artie says hi in the chat. Oh, it's over there. God, that's well hidden. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't know what I did. I, I, I smushed it. Uh, I smushed the floor. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, hang on a sec. I hope I can unsmush the floor. We unsmushed the floor, fantastic. Uh, let's, let's get our thingy on. And go, oops, oh god, that was a bit fast. Go see to the crops. Right, we need one carrot. We need one onion. We need one. Potatoes. I've realised I should be writing this down, so I'm going to open a notepad a little real quick. Uh, one carrot, one on onion, four potatoes. Uh, what have we got in this row? <laughs> Hang on. Uh, pumpkins! Ah, okay, we need four pumpkins. Let's write that down for pumpkin. Um, well, we've got some pumpkins here, which is lovely. Our bushes are doing well as well. Ah, oh, oh, we have a shaka in the chat. Welcome. How's it going? Okay, that is everything what needs. Uh, harvesting. Hang on. Uh, I'm gonna line up a dinosaur, but it doesn't really want to be lined up. There we go. Two, three, four. It's sure going. It sure is. All right. What have we got in these rows? I'm bumped again. Cauliflower, lettuce, watermelon, pineapple. Write that down. Lettuce, one melon, pineapple, one bowl. Alright. Oh, ah! I didn't plow it! I got all ready to plow and then didn't plow! There we go. Ah, oh. but yeah, how is uni going? I hope it's treating you well. They must have changed, like, the, the AI pathfinding on this plowing. Because it is so much better at locking on than it was before. Alright. And now time to drop water and everything. You didn't plow? <laughs> I've plowed now! Uh, we moved on to new things in programming and your brain is fried. Oh no! Uh, we need that! Can't be fried, it's important. Ugh. I wish they'd, uh, they'd changed the, the, the spread on the um, 
watering, that would have been nice. To be able to get things. <laughs> These two here, I just can't, can't get. And that one in the corner, I also can't get. Okay, we got those two. Let's plug this. Right, come over here. Oh my god, Salty. <laughs> Sweetie! Ah. Uh. <laughs> says, you're right. I need my brain house while I flirt with people. That's not why you need your brain, that's just like an added benefit. Uh, your brain is important to keep you going. We're gonna get there eventually. Glug, glug, glug. It's such a satisfying sound when Salty picks up the water though. Oh my gosh. Even if the, the steering is pretty bad. And this is taking forever. We're gonna spend half the day just here trying to... Trying to do this farm. <laughs> And it's annoying because it's it's ostensibly quicker to do it this way than to do it manually, assuming that the dinosaur actually gets the plants that need watering. Okay, is that all of the water plants? That is all of the plants watered. Let's go into town, pick up them uh, things, what we need. I think maybe also about what quests we have to do. Uh, we're still, we're, we're pretty low on quests. We've done almost all of them. Marie doesn't have anything for us today. We're gonna run Salty into town and back. Then I think we're gonna need to uh, swap them out. Pippin's not around today. It's fine. <laughs> Isn't that a mood? Okay, uh, the other question is, will he have enough money for all of the things? Seems like the answer is yes. Oh. Okay, fine. You, you, I had to sell you this one apple separately, apparently. Uh, Alright, Marlo's also not here, so we'll have to go and find him. That's fine. Uh, right, what are we buying? One carrot. One onion. Four potatoes. Four pumpkins. Uh, one cauliflower. One lettuce. And then a melon and a pineapple, which I need to get from the desert. Which is fine. Ah, we have a king girl in the chat. Welcome. The only other queer person at work is on holiday, so it's extra straight, and my coping is being even gayer online. Oh, that's such a disaster, but I'm glad you are choosing to share your extra gay with us. Uh, I don't think we're going to make it to the desert and back on this much stamina. So we'll just grab all the free stuff that we have around here and then head back and we'll swap you out for somebody else, Salty. Um, we also need to think about what fertilizer our crops need. Uh, right, Collie is firm. Lettuce is also firm. Uh, potatoes also firm. Okay. Carrot in here. Boop. Onion. There. 
potatoes. Because <laughs> says the extra gay was my role in high school. Collie and Lattice both need farm. Uh, and then the potatoes also needed farm. So we need to get some more farm. Do I have more farm in the house? I do, I have loads. Uh, let's actually grab Lucky. Bit well, we're here. The girl does really love the Ankarasaur design. I love pretty much all of the designs in this. The the Desmatosuchus looks a little weird, but then Desmatosuchus, yeah, Desmatosuchus just looks weird. <laughs> so I can't really blame them for making a weird-looking animal look weird, you know. Right, the pumpkin and I think the carrot need sticky. Yeah, okay. And then the onion. Uh, onion? Spring onion? Spring onion needs soft. What do the melon and pineapple need? They also need sticky. Okay. Do do do. Very fair, very fair. Alright, let's hop on over here to home, dump all of this stuff, what we don't need to be carrying around with us. Uh, go to the desert to find seeds. Oh, clear this. Go to the desert to find seeds, go to the forest to find Mala, because he'll be at home, I guess. Run, lucky, run, lucky, run, run, run. We don't take lucky out enough nowadays. We've got so many dinos, and because I, I like having the different like clearing abilities because I keep finding places that I need to clear while I'm just randomly out and about. So having the, someone to do each of the different things. Ah, Sarah's here. Hello. It's always a pleasure to see you too. Share discovery. Right, I've had a while to your journal. Okay. We're so close. I've found so many fragments. Uh, I would. Okay. Great. <laughs> she hasn't actually told us anything. She's just written it down. Uh, and I have no idea. Oh, it was like this, a grain storage pot. This is what the grain, the clay fragments were. I see. Ancient grain pot has been in the Agami family for generations. This is just Granny's old pot. This isn't archaeology. <laughs> oh dear. Right, thingy thingy is there. Uh, we need to find seed lady. Hello. Seed person. Is it you? I don't think it's you. It's not you. Where are you, seed person? Are you seed person? No. 
you're a fruit person. Is seed person not in today? I don't know where seed person normally stands. I have seen suspicion it's that stall. God damn. Okay, we'll need to do our seeds ourselves. It's a good job that I always have a backup. But anyway. Uh, let us away to the forest to go speak to Marlo. And, and wish him happy birthday. And we've gone a strange way to get there. But that's fine. Apparently we're leveling up Artie as we go, so that's good. I really might need to look in a guide for, for finding this last ancient tablet fragment. Even finding it in a guide is going to be a pain, because obviously there'll be 19 locations there that I have checked, and only one location that I haven't, and I don't know which one's which. Um, I might put up a poll, actually. I'll ask you guys how you feel about me looking at a guide. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Twitch? S -g -g create a dashboard. There we go. I'll put up a wee little poll. You guys can have your say on, on what you think about cheating. Uh, make it a five minute poll, there we go. There you are, there's a poll for you. Uh... <laughs> Cause I, I'm not sure. Like, I'd like to do it without looking it up if I can. The problem is, we spent a long time last stream looking for ancient tablet fragments and didn't... We found one, but we didn't find the last one. And I don't want to just spend <clears throat> aeons and aeons. I am so lost. Where am I going? <laughs> I want to spend aeons and aeons looking around in the same places for these things that clearly aren't there. Alright, to the woods with us. Um, somewhere, probably. Here's the woods, there we go. Where's that? There we go. So it's not eaten all of my resources. I see Molo is here, and I can see. Okay. Alright, go to Molo's. Because I, I, I suspect it's at the bottom of that water, and I don't know how to get to the bottom of that water. I've never seen it empty. What's the weather today? Today's weather is cloudy. Hey Marlo! Greetings Disney! So glad you've waked my budding day! It's one of my favourite days of the year. A day to appreciate trees is a day made for me. What kind of woodsman would I be if I didn't look after my tree? What would you like to do? Give gift. Gift this blueberry jam, yes. You really don't have to cook me anything. Don't worry, I didn't. It does smell great, thank you. So glad you can make it, I really appreciate it. Look how thick that trunk's got! It's the mark of a good tree. Indeed. Well, I hope you enjoy the jam. Uh, I'm gonna wander over here and have a look and see what the Vanishing Water's doing today. But possibly only if I can find them. Well, they don't look very vanished. They look kind of just the same as they always look, to be honest. How ucks. I still haven't figured out how to, to uncover these truffles, actually. 
Oh, Lucky can do it. Oh, okay. Oh, I hadn't realised that. I guess there's a, a good reason then for bringing Lucky out. That I was hitherto completely unaware of. Uh, well, while I'm here, I'm just going to gather stuff. Keep looking at all the crannies of the forest, because I think that's the most likely place for something to be hidden that I haven't found if it's not in the the mysteriously vanishing waters. Oh, and Artie has redeemed a hydrate. Thank you so much. Let me get on that. Well, the reason stream viewing was late today was because uh, we had a house viewing. We've had a number of house viewings recently. Oh, hello. You're very pretty. Hi there. I got off as, as if I was going to pet it, but it's a wild one. They don't let you pet them. Um, uh, where was I? Yeah, we've, we've had a, we had a house viewing today. We've had a few recently. But uh, it was such a mad panic getting the house like ready in advance that I barely had anything to drink. So I did, I did, once it was over, just sit down and glug like an entire two glasses of drink. <laughs> so uh, you'll forgive me if my, my little hydrates are not huge hydrates. Does any of this look new? I don't even know where we are, to be honest. Um, we're near the tree ceratops. Oh, okay. It's starting to get late and dark as well. I was like, oh, well, I, I now know how to get those truffles. So we'll, we'll go around and I'll dig up all the truffles. I've not seen any other truffles since. <laughs> Good job, Dizzy. Um, I also haven't seen any forest wood, which is a shame because it's a it's a good resource to get your hands on when you can. It is seriously getting late now, so uh, might be time to turn it back. Here's gloves. This family, the Therizinosauruses. Hello. There's gonna be anything behind these bushes. So they're not like blocking off. Normally it's quite clear when something is being blocked off. I suppose we can slash him down anyway. Just on the off chance. That's not anything, is it? Alright, let's go back to the bushes, chop the bushes. Because we actually, I'm not sure if we've ever used gloves to actually slash stuff. Also, you're a very pretty colour of, uh... You're a very pretty colour of Therizinosaurus yourself. Right, where's gloves? There's gloves. This toothless looking ass. Oh, oh, I like the animation. It's, honestly, it's a much nicer slashing animation than Species is, where you sort of got to turn the whole dinosaur around. It's time for us to head for home. Alright, poll has ended with yay cheating, getting 100% of the vote. That's not the way home. So, once today is over, which will be very soon, we will, uh, I'll go and, and have a, a quick little Google and see where this last piece is. Uh, any more forest wood for me? Yeah, a little bit. Marvelous. Uh, we missed the shortcut, that's fine. Grab these hazelnuts while we're here. I find it interesting that there's both hazelnuts on the bush and hazelnuts not on the bush. I missed the first way out. First way out. Like, I'd sort of expect them to just be kind of one or the other. But it's not, it's both. Ah, okie doke. Doo -doo -doo. Food. We love great food. If anyone ever tells you they don't love great food, they are either a 
liar or a fool. <laughs> Alright, now we need to go and grab a pumpkin and a melon seed. I need to update my little notepad. So that I need to buy, buy those things. Dump all of the stuff in the storage. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba, seeds. Melon. Oh, don't tell me I don't have pumpkin. Uh, pineapple. Oh, I do have pineapple. Okay. Fantastic. So away we go. We nearly have. Uh, we nearly have everything set out the way we want it. We're pretty close. Really, just kind of waiting for these chilies to finish. And then everything is in its nice rows now, I think. The chilies finished, and also the turnips I wanted to replace with corn, which is why I've got the corn on me. Um, the, the chilies will be replaced with strawberries. I don't know if I can get strawberry seeds right now. So we might end up replacing the chilies with corn and keeping the turnips because I don't otherwise have a place for turnips. We we don't have enough enough space to have one row of every crop currently, uh, which is a bit of a shame. Well, I mean we could do it, but it would be so much more additional watering effort, which is already a bit of a faff. I, I'm not particularly keen. Oh yeah, look, I've got the strawberry seeds already. That's nice. Uh, but yeah, we don't currently have a row for beetroot. We don't have a row for garlic, but I don't mind not having a row for garlic because that's like a wild herb. Um. Yeah. So what is it? We we need beetroot, rhubarb. We don't have a row for and turnips or corn, one or the other. Shaq says, I was speaking of turnips, you need to get the new Turnip Boy game. I... I, I haven't missed out, technically speaking, on the, the Turnip Boy games, but like I, I haven't played them yet, and they the, it does look really good, the first one. Uh, Alright, let's, let's go have a Google. Uh, ancient... Tablet... Fragments... Paleo... Uh all ancient tablet and tablet fragment locations. This is from thegamer.com. Uh I'm gonna I'm gonna just scroll down to Dapplewood Forest and see if there is one in the, the thingy waters. Western Dapplewoods, next to a blue flower and mossy rock at the edge of a small lake with a waterfall. I don't know if I've gotten that one. Okay, it doesn't seem to be at the bottom of those waters. So that's good news. I don't know what the the, the deal with the waters is then, because we have seen their levels change. But I guess tomorrow we will just go through all of these kind of one by one, perhaps. Ugh. Shaq says, I played the first one that was in the Jingle Jam bundle and fell in love. Maybe I own it then. Salty needs attention and six crops to harvest. That is pretty good going, honestly. That's a fairly clear day. I will actually just double check that what you need attention for is a clean out rather than food. Oh no, you need food. Okay, that's fine. We can get you food. Oh, okay. Or well, we can get stuck, one of the two. Oh, storage. Get out all of this kind of kibble. I don't think you can take all of the kind of kibble. I think you only got a little 
tray. Well, that's fine. Oh, wow, yeah, you ate all of that. <laughs> Good job. Alright. Let's go say hi to everyone else. TJ is going to be our Starachosaurus for today. <laughs> Not really what I had planned, but that's fine. Um, lucky. And species hide there. Right, now, because it's raining, we'll have a little bit more stamina to spend on just running around like a man thing, which is good. So I had to gloves. Gloves, you're coming with us. As is Marty. Stereochromus, you're not. Currently. Look. I'm not sure if I said hi to you two yesterday. But we'll come say hi to you now. Hi, Boom Boom. How's it going? With the little dance that we love. And Zoe, who is currently very flowery. Lovely. Love to see it. Okay, let's go. Ooh, I think we just ran over a dinosaur. Let's go take a look and see who needs harvesting. Ah, carrots! Carrots is all well and good. Carrots is easy. Grab TJ. Get our plowing game on. That was a silly thing to do. I'm oh, sorry, I need six. There we go. Right. Let's head out to grab the seeds because I don't know where a gummy's going to be. I could check where a gummy's going to be. Uh, trading in Pebble Plaza, fantastic. In the meantime. Oh, there's two people with quests up there. Hello, Ray. I need six of your finest carrot seeds, please. And actually, I might want to hold off and wait for... Because now that we've got all of our rows basically sorted... Hello, Pippin Sotel Owen. Owen, your books were kind of dull. I figured out if you spoke to me in person, I can't fall asleep this time. <laughs> you fell asleep while reading? I'm afraid I don't understand. Don't worry about it, just focus. I have questions, and you have a big brain, right? So you can give me answers. Oh, well, I shall try my best. But maybe difficult to give you a full picture without the references. Question one, dreamstones. Every dinosaur needs one, right? But I've never seen one up close. Seems like they're kind of a rarity, especially where I lived in the swamp. I must say, Pippin, I'm quite fascinated by the swamp region myself. The smells, for instance. Do you chlorinate the swamp land? Uh, no. It's stinkier than the Stegosaurus. It's the best. I've heard rumours of water-drowning dinosaurs in the region. Is that correct? Is this a DLC tease? Or is there a fourth region that I don't know about? Sure, there's all kinds of dinosaurs, but... That is astonishing. And poppins, are those a native recipe? Mostly, but I put my own crunch into them. <laughs> I think Pippin asked you here to ask you questions, Owen, but hey-ho. I 
there includes any of the facts you've just told me, I'm off home to write them down before I forget. <laughs> wow! Oh my god, someone managed to outrude Pippin, which is a, a surprise. That not really help, maybe you can instead. You use dreamstones on your farm, right? Maybe you could bring me one to look at. Sure. That seems eminently achievable. Alright, let's sell off these carrots. Hide right there. You'll be back. I mean, I will, yes. You're one of only two people who will buy stuff from me. Of course I'll be back. Ugh. Oh. Um, up, salty. Take me to the desert, please. So we can buy the seeds that we weren't able to buy yesterday. Up, up, up. Seed person, you better be here. You're not a seed person, are you? I really hope you're not a seed person, and I didn't just ignore you last time. Because you're the one who's just weirdly not connected to everyone. No, you're a food person, that's fine. We don't need food person. Food person is superfluous requirements. There's Zara, there's Travelling Archie, or whatever his name is. Okay. Seed person? <laughs> we can just tell if you like, by the way, I have seeds on the brain. Sometimes I sing my seeds to sleep for science. I love it. Um. Buh -buh -buh. What am I looking for? One, uh, one pineapple. One melon seed. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. I don't have any other bushes that I don't have. I don't have any blueberry bushes, I don't think. Or maybe it's blackberry bushes? One of the two. Either way, I'm not that fussed by them. Okay, okay. Guys, please. Uh, let's actually go and speak to the cactus before I leave the desert. Because it's always good to speak to the cactus. I really want to find out what the cactus deal is. <laughs> uh, you may, King Girl, but uh, I don't know if I can reasonably give you an answer. <laughs> I saw a rock here, let's give that a whack with TJ while we're here. That's it. I guess we just missed that one beforehand. <laughs> the way the little one runs. That a lot of the animations are so cute in this game. Big T-Rex boy, hello. Uh cactus. Hi there. The bigger the poop, the bigger the dino. <laughs> Thanks for your wisdom. I think I could have sworn we'd smashed this already. Maybe that maybe that one respawns. Huh. There's other rocks down here, but I don't think there's stuff behind them. No, there's nothing behind them. This Allosaurus always confuses me because I, I, I've come past the T-Rex and I turn around and I'm like, oh, that's not a T-Rex. <laughs> and it confuses me and, and befuddles me. I, I'm only weak of brain. Imagine if the last fragment had just been right there and I'd been walking past it this whole time. Imagine how cross it would have been. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's get home. Grab that dreamstone. And then get on the hunt. Because we are 
amazing daylight. Something drastic. Storage. Uh... Right, and I'm not going to do the carrots today. I'm going to wait. I'm actually also not going to do these two today either. I'm going to wait until everything's ready to all sync up. That's the plan. Uh, so, let's grab Lucky, because Salty is nearly out. And if we're going to the forest at any point, we might be able to use Lucky to pick up some truffles. As it turns out, that's the thing. Smash these, because they're annoying. Right. said like oh we we won't be spending so much time today but it's it's nearly midday and we haven't even started the hunt yet <laughs> hi i still want to see a dreamstone you have to look at this big one it's so pretty your dinosaurs sleep in one of these yes that's really cool i hope it gives them the best dreams yes i don't need to keep this one though you should have it back take this too learning always leaves me starving thanks I've been thinking about what Owen said when we talked before. He's right about the swamp, isn't he? It's a pretty wonderful place to be from. It's fun to learn about how things work here, for sure. Seeing how excited Owen got about the swamp, maybe everyone else would be interested in learning about the swamp too. I've been thinking, since we're going to be best friends forever, I think you should get a lifetime discount at my stall. Now you can have as many poppins as you need. Oh, yeah, BFF discount, 20%. For those things that I use hardly any of, but thanks. Thanks anyway. Off we go. I'd use more if I didn't look up what the different dinos wanted. Okay, who's not with us? Gloves isn't with us. Right. So, let's have a look at this little guide. There are eight fragments in Viridian Valley. Number one, in southern Viridian Valley, by some bushes on a hill that overlooks the campsite north of Pebble Plaza. What does that mean? What does that mean in English? By some bushes on a hill that overlooks the campsite north of Pebble Plaza. Okay, I wouldn't have called that southern Viridian Valley. But this is the plaza, we go north, there's the campsite, and there's nothing here, so we've got this one. Uh, in Southern Viridian Valley, behind the apple tree, at the edge of the hidden pond near the exit to Dapplewood. Or the entrance to Dapplewood, rather. Okay, so, behind uh, the hidden pond, we know where the hidden pond is, free food! There's an apple tree here. Okie doke. And then it's, it would be by these stones, according to the reference picture. So we've got that one. Okie doke. Number three, Eastern Viridian Valley. That's on the right hand side. At the base of a pink bush on the edge of the lake next to Owen's house. Okay, the pink bush might not be pink in this season. We'll <laughs> we'll deal with that technicality when we get there. It might have been easy to go to the other bridge, actually. But hey ho, I don't think these are in any kind of sensible order either. So we might be running back and forth a few times. Right. Okay. Here's the lake. Uh, north to Owen's house, go around the edge of the lake, following the path, each side will be a base of a pink bush. That's all the instruction it gives. Are there any pink bushes? That's a pink bush. I think that's the pink bush in the picture. And I don't think there's a fragment here. Uh, okay. So we 
we've got that one. Number four, in northern Viridian Valley, at the base of a birch tree, on the ridge directly behind Propeka's pen. That sounds like somewhere we might not have seen. Uh, I've gone the wrong way. Again. I'm really bad at leaving Owen's house today, apparently. Nope, not that way either. Get it together, Dizzy. Right, I need to go across the bridge. Preaker's pen. Because I, I don't go up here. Where is Paprika's pen? I think this is Paprika's pen. Uh, at the base of a birch tree on the ridge. Oh my gosh! We found it, gang. This is the last one. This is it. Oh my gosh. Let's go to Zara. I'm assuming that's going to say, yeah, an artifact can be shown to Zara. I really hope Zara's in today. Uh, otherwise, I'm going to be really disappointed. It says at home at Ariacotta Canyon, but that doesn't always mean you can find her. Oh my gosh, lucky! Lucky, we might have did it! We might have did it with only a small amount of cheating! Oh, Owen's here. Hi there, Owen. Got a quest for us. Hi, Bongo. Hi Dizzy, sorry I'm not really in a chit chat mood today. Why not? As you can probably guess, my attempt at art didn't go so well. Long story short, Bongo spilled half the pigments and ate the rest. Do you know how hard paint is to get out of furniture? Or dinosaur feathers? <laughs> Maybe I should run away and join Avery Avery's theatre troupe. Not that I'd be any help. Painting dinosaurs? Look at my track record. <laughs> Owen, please don't make, make yourself Make Bongo cross with you as well as Marie, please. You know what they say, when life gives you lemons, make lemon pie. I sure could go for a slice of lemon pie as a pick-me-up. Back to Bongo's mess. Jack says, I've had the stream minimized, I'm just thinking of the comment, oh dear. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, quest added, cheer Owen up. Bake a lemon meringue pie, bring to Owen. Okay, what do I need to make a lemon meringue pie? Probably lemons. I don't think I knew that lemons were in the game. Uh, I hope I hope I have the recipe for lemon meringue pie. Otherwise, it's going to be a bit tricky. I do not have the recipe for lemon meringue pie. I have rice and pancakes and soup. <laughs> hmm. Uh, anyway, from Owen's house, uh, to get to the desert, where the fudge am I? Is, to get to the desert is not this way, but this is the way we're going, apparently. <laughs> Alright, I've got to get to Zara quickly before she decides to go indoors. Come on, Lucky! Speed! Judge! We're so close! Noom! Noom! Faster! Wait, is Zara there? Zara is there! Noom! Top speed! <laughs> Faster! Hey! Hey, does he have any new discoveries? Yes! I'll get to work restoring this straight away. This is the last tablet by my estimation. Good thing I have my restoration tools right here. Okay. Then, I'll see if we can decide the, decipher the last message. A chasm long and deep and wide. It's a perfect place for dinosaurs to hide. Mm. It's an enigma, no? Perhaps we read all the clues we have together. Creatures with the crest dearly love to roam. They'll always come running when you call them home. Let the music of your heart call back when there's a part. Under a sea of stars, noise travels far. A chasm long and deep and wide is the perfect place for dinosaurs to hide. So we need to be in Aricotta Canyon, it needs to be night, uh, and we need to play I'm Guessing Lucky's Friend song. 
We know it must refer to the Parasaurolophus. I'm sure these tablets were left by the flute bearers, given the musical notes. It's almost like it's telling us to play something. At night, but where is the chasm? Wait, I've got it! The chasm long and deep and wide, you must know it well, Dizzy! Ahem! <laughs> <laughs> well, Zara! <clears throat> the Ariacotta Canyon. Yeah, I know that. Canyons are deep valleys created by river erosion. The dinosaur could definitely hide there. That's where the Parasaurolophus must be. And I know just the spot. You can tell from the stone of this tablet. It comes from a specific area in the canyon. Using that, I can track the location where this tablet may have originally stood. In fact, I'll place the tablet back there in pride of place. You'll know exactly where to go. Simply stand in front of this tablet under a sea of stars at night, and play your flute. <laughs> okay. Please let me know how it goes, I can hardly wait. Here, take this with you. Chocolicious. One should never embark on the journey without cake! Okay, quest added, music of the night. Go to Ariacotta Canyon with Lucky, stand at the flute bearer tablet, play the flute at midnight. Okay, it has to be at midnight. Gotcha. Is this... Is this whole area Area Cotter Canyon? Or is only a bit of it Area Cotter Canyon? I suppose we need to find out where the, where the flute... Where the tablet is. Because she's, she's hidden it. Somewhere. In the world. If I had to guess, I might suggest it'll be down in that little gulch bit. But I'll check everywhere else, just in case. That's the way to lecture. Oh, enjoy your lecture. I will do my best to enjoy the rest of the stream. I hope you have a fun lecture and it doesn't scramble your brain too much. I think it's down there. That's where I'd expect it to be. I can't see it down there though. Hmm. Kingler's also heading off after lunch. Give the underfeathered friends your love. I will. I will be sure to do just that. Okay. Right. I'm a little bit not sure where we're going. Um, well, it's not here, which is where I'd expect it to be. So, where the hell... Where the hell did this tablet get put? <laughs> Cactus, do you have any any clues for me? No? Okay. I wonder if I can like slash open the cactus with gloves. Or, or interact with it with any of my dinosaurs. We've got until midnight to like find this thing. So I might as well muck around for a bit first. those spikes. <laughs> Hi, I've come to knock your house down. Oh god, it, it makes the screen shake when you run Artie directly into it. Uh, hi, Graham. I am mildly confused by your input. Um, I, I hope everything's going well, question mark? kind of doesn't sound like it's going well. <laughs> Wallop it. Wallop this one. Oh, Lucky is feeling very lovey at the moment. Let's go 
look for this fully. So we've we've looked pretty much everywhere on this side of the map. Uh, we might not have looked up. No, we have looked up there. Okay. So must therefore be on the left hand side. Oh, TJ's had a lovely level up. That's grand. I like how Zara was like, oh, you can tell from this one specific type of rock, but it didn't tell me which type of rock it was. Hi, have you seen a, a tablet anywhere? My friend came through with it and put it down while I wasn't looking. It's getting dark. Hey guys, any of you got a tablet? No, you got some bushes for gloves though. Gloves! Destroy. That's such a fun animation. Tablets, tablets, tablets. Come on, Lucky, let's... Let's look all around this bit first, and then we'll try the desert bit. Because the desert feels like the least canyony place of all the places. Um... I'm not seeing a flute here either. Oh, I think we made those posters super cross. Tablet? Big rocks? Big rocks, no tablet. Come on, TJ. Let's clear out these big rocks. Density bit it is, I guess. We don't have to do this tonight, but it would be great if we could do it tonight. Uh, tablet? Hello? Tablet? Um, oh wow, you're a very pretty colour. I wonder if that's an unusual colour. I'm gonna quickly tab out uh, and double check if that's an unusual colour of Carnotaurus. Hope you'll forgive me. Colour patterns. No, that is actually a very common colour of Carnotaurus. <laughs> No less pretty, but tremendously common. Okay. Uh, I feel like in terms of, of finding tablets, I am not succeeding. <laughs> uh, this is a little bit of a disaster, isn't it? Maybe I need to leave and re-enter the area, possibly? To see the, the tablets. That'll be a pain if that's the case. Oh, Boba. It's not in your, your you guys' pot, is it? Hello? No, but there are some bushes in here. Gloves! Do your worst. Oh, there's a dreamstone behind us. Thanks, gloves. Okay, this uh, this tablet might be, might elude us for today, possibly. Graham's 
says, likely st gonna still be working till 8 p.m. onwards. You don't get a lunch today. Oh, yeah, that would make me grumpy as well, Graham. That's rough. I feel like that oughtn't to be legal, but I also know that, uh, you know, this is Britain that we live in. Such things are not much the concern of our capitalist overlords. Where? Okay, I'm gonna go out and come back. <laughs> Okay, right. This must- Oh, it's here! Hello! This must be it, Lucky. It is a bit spooky. Guess there's only one thing for it. Play the flute. Uh-oh. I don't know what song to play. Maybe it has the music of my heart. Sounds pretty good, huh? Let's hope the Parasaurolophuses hear it. Now what? I guess I can try again. Oops. No, we've come so far. Maybe I'm just not playing loud enough. Play the flute as loud as you can. Okay, I don't know how to play louder, but we'll give it a go. Doesn't look like any Parasaurolophuses are coming. Oh, Pep! Maybe we were wrong. Maybe it's just you and me, Lucky. Oh, sweetie. Well, we're back home. At midnight. I'm sorry we didn't find them, Lucky. We did everything we could. You might be the only Parasaurolophus, but you're still my family. Oh, precious. It's been a long day, right? Time for bed. But wait. Oh. Oh. Lucky has off run. Morning! Uh... Okay, Lucky is, is nominally still in their pen. I have a sneaky suspicion we're going to find out they are in fact not. In just a second. Three dinos need attention. 32 crops to harvest! Oh god. Okay, you guys need to clean. That's fine. Oh, I forgot to actually give you a little scritch. We'll do that quickly. I thought I heard noises in the night. Have you seen Lucky this morning? What about you, Salty? Have you seen Lucky this morning? Morning, guys! I wonder where Lucky has gone. You can come with us today. You seen Lucky? We need a slasher. Doesn't mean it has to be has to be uh, gloves. Oops. Grab these apples while we're here. Go say hi to this lot. Oh, Artie! Don't ram gloves. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right. So he's here. Hi. Hey, Boomer's come over for a scritch. You're such a well-behaved dinosaur. Normally, people run off and avoid their scritches. Makes it really difficult. Uh. I didn't really mean to ride you. I was meaning to ride Salty. Uh, there we go. Because I gotta run over this way. Pick absolutely loads of things. So many things. Okay, so that's two carrots. I need to write this down because I will forget. Right, uh, two carrots. Is my is mine add quote or quote add? I believe mine is add quote. One, two, three, four, five spring onions. Uh oh gosh, the peppers are in. Luckily they don't really plant. These chilies might do. Uh oh, not enough room in my inventory. <laughs> Whoopsies! Let's go deal with that. Super quick. Oh, come on, it's not going to be able to afford all this. It's all the stuff we don't need. Which there is actually quite a lot. Uh, <laughs> you for adding that as a quote afterwards. Uh, okay, okay. okay, the chilies don't need any plant just yet. Lucky. Good. Let me have this lattice, thank you. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six lattices. Uh, and we're not replanting these as turnips, we're replanting these as corn. We decided. Is that everything? That's everything harvested. Okay, Higeshi. Time to plow. Uh, we're gonna plant all of our carrots this time, because uh, otherwise we're just waiting on like one carrot, which seems silly. Uh, and we're gonna replant the onions as well. Okay, I think that's all the spaces that need a plow. So let's get salty. Get spraying. Oh, the animations are not happy today, are they? They're really, really unhappy. Oh boy. Alright, I, I can't quite tell how many still need some water. There's some over here at least. Other dinos are all in the way right now. <laughs> Guys, please. You're killing me. 
and you're killing that one chili pot that I can't reach. <laughs> Come on, Salty, you can do it. I, I know you can, I know you have it in you. There we go. Alright. I feel good we can do this in two more sprays. Oh, maybe we can do it in one more spray. Amazing. Okie dokie, let's go fetch Boom Boom as our premium sprinter. Up, come back. Hi. I might need you today. Uh, free food, free food. Always important. <clears throat> Although I guess we're probably quite near the end of the story of the game. Hey Granny! Now you know, I'm not one for gossip or getting all up in anyone's grill. I can't be the only one who's noticed that Marie and Owen still ain't made up. They've definitely started to miss each other's talents, even if they haven't said so. Seen Marie flubbering with her notes, ain't ya? And Owen stomping in circles like a headless herbosaur. <laughs> they ain't realised they need the other one yet, that's all. However, they don't call me Granny Genius for nothing. Remember how much the two of them flipped their flops when you came home with a brand new di desert dino? Well, they forgot everything short of their own names. Now, just imagine what would happen if you gave them a chance to be the rare dinosaur. What do you mean, what's a rare dinosaur? The wild ones with the wacky colours! Oh no, I've got several! <laughs> Surely you've seen them in all your zany travels. If you're on board with this plan, befriend a rare dinosaur and invite them to your ranch. Nothing gets those who talk in like their craze for our feathered and scaly friends. Oh, that's hard though! There's like not many rare dinos out there, that's why they're called rare. Trait. Right, hello. I have loads of stuff to sell. Uh, I'm actually going to keep hold of the apples. Just so I have a, a decent stock, because these are all like lowest class apples. Ah, also, he's out of money. <laughs> oh dear, that's fine. If this has any problems, let me know. Which seems decidedly uncalled like. Hi, I'd like to buy two carrot seeds, uh, five onion seeds, uh, and six lettuce seeds, please. Thank you. Alright. Let's head back home. Get these in the ground and fertilised. Uh, who's not where my species is worse? Let's go. I'm going to need to pick up some more carrot seeds as well. And all of my fertilizer stock, probably. You can go, you can go, you can go. Uh, seeds and fertilizer. Give me that. Uh, carrot seeds. Just so many carrot seeds. Carrots. One, two, three, four, five. I'm also going to need to make some sticky fertilizer, actually, aren't I? For all of these guys. Because I don't think I have enough. Well, I might have enough. Not many things need sticky. Yeah. 
dirt and a corn to put them in here. I have no idea what corn needs. I don't know if we've even registered it. We have not. Okay, let's look at what corn needs. Uh, corn, corn needs soft. Excellent. Soft is always the best one to need. Because soft is the one we produce most of. Uh, and then lettuce. Which I think needs fur. I will double check. Everything planted? Oh, there's everything planted. Amazing. Good job, us. That's everything planted. Alright. Well, we'll head off to the desert. Partly because that's where I assume Lucky is. Uh, and partly because that will be a place where we can sell these remaining things. Uh... So I haven't figured out how to make a lemon meringue pie, or uh, any pie, actually. Um, find Lucky. Sure. Oh. I didn't decide to join our party then briefly. You don't normally get to have four dinos in the party while you're in here. Yum. The flute tablet was right near to the entrance to Ariacarta Canyon, so I assume that as soon as we cross this boundary we'll find Lucky. We did not. Oh, we can't even interact with this, that's a shame. Okay. Um... Hmm. Oh, hello! Footprints! Did she come all the way out here alone? C'est possible. Uh, what way do we think that footprint is going? This way. At least there's a trail to follow. Hello! Lucky! Another footprint! A lot of winds. Where do we think? Uh, across the bridge? Yes, okay. Footprints. Lucky! Hello! Where are you? Lucky, sweetie pea! Another one? She can't be that much further. <laughs> That's what you think. Left or right? I think right. Oh yes, the footprint. Someone must have seen her. Let's keep going straight for now. There we go, another one. That's a lucky footprint. Lucky doke. Lucky! I'm on the right track. I don't need to do this bit on fur as it turns out. It's quite a... A lengthy journey. She must be around somewhere. As long as I keep following her footprints. Lucky! <clears throat> I'm sure to find her soon, I hope. Oh, we got a cutscene. That's normally good. There's Lucky! Hi! Is that the promising tail I see over there to the right? It is! Hello! Lucky! Where did you go? Do you know how worried I was? You can't just disappear like that without a goodbye. I'm so relieved you're okay. Why on earth would you... 
Oh my. Are they? Did you? You found it! Hey! I can't believe it. Look at them. Hello there. We found all those clues you left. Guess you heard our song, huh? You took your time coming. Where have you been hiding all this time? Oh, I see. I'm supposed to be talking to them, not Lucky. Owen and Marie are going to be thrilled. Well, Lucky, worth the move to Paleo Pines? <laughs> Do you think the parasols would like to come home with us to the valley? We've still new adventures to have and the rush to run. How else are we going to keep feeding you poppins? Amazing. Oh, and I guess that is officially the end of the game. Oh, well that was wonderful. That was super sweet. Right, do I need to click to see the next page? Okay, I need to click to see the next page. <laughs> Oh, well that was fantastic. I'm glad we got to finish this. I I don't know, I'm assuming some people in like this section and also the, the animate person. Uh, like I'm assuming these are the people to thank for how absolutely fantastic the dinosaurs look. Uh, because they all look amazing. Like, like to a... To a T? Maybe to a D, I guess, because they're dinosaurs. They all look fantastic. Uh, the game is super sweet. Oh, they have a paleontology consultant. That's definitely someone to thank. <laughs> Natalia. Uh, I'm going to guess that's a soft J, so Jagielska? Or maybe Jagielska? Good job, Natalia. Uh, level designers and, and other such things. Narrative design and world building. We saw Natalia again there for some reason. Have I? Have I? Oh, uh. Okay. It's weird. I, I'm sure we saw the same pages several times there. And then all the different languages. Apparently there was voice acting. <laughs> voice acting. Me. <laughs> Oh, I see! These are the people who made like the dino noises and stuff. Oh, that's cool. Cassie White did a lot of them. Nice. Oh, amazing. So these are all the people you hear going, rawr, rawr, rawr. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about having a click through credits. Like, I'd much rather they were they were gone at not my pace, because I don't know what the right pace is. But uh Wonderful people, I'm sure, who who all made this thing happen. We've had the music go to like its final climax like three times now. <laughs> um On behalf of Northern Ireland Screen Legal Services Restart interns, early concept testers, special thanks section, and development partners, production babies and pets. Oh my god, two whole pages of pets. Oh no, Tina, poor Tina. Oh, I love one of them is called Spider Man. <laughs> Oh, well that's wonderful. Hi guys! Now, there's something very important that I have to do. Oh, I have to find out what your friend call is, for one thing. Uh, that was 3, 2, 4. And then something. 3, 2, 4, 2, 4, 1, 2, 4. Three, two, four, two, four. That was a three. Three, two, four, two, four, one, two, four, possibly? Oh, she's going backwards. She doesn't like that at all. God, this is a hard call. Three, two, four, two, four, one, two, four. Okay.
Did we get it? I think we got it. Amazing. Parasaurolophus is curious about you. Well, I'm curious about you, which is why you're going naps. <laughs> oh yeah, get the book out. Parasaurolophus got paws. Oh, there's a sleeping one over there anyway. I need to put this one to sleep. Parasaurolophus discovered. Amazing. Wisteria is a common colour. Shamrock is an uncommon colour. What about you? Hi. I don't think I can check your colour while you're still awake. No, okay. Hello? Right. Three, two, four. Two, four. One, two, four. There we go. <laughs> Oh wow, you're like, it's a shame that I don't have any poppets, because you just pop straight into the right place. Nap time! Alright, let's quickly just see if you have to be on common colour. You're tangerine, you're a common colour, that's very fine. Oh, because yeah, we do still have quests. Amazing, completed the Parasolophus puzzle. Um... I need to find, a, find out how to make... Oh, befriend a new Parasolophus pal. That's a quest that we have, apparently. Uh, lucky, 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 lucky. Do we know what, what dinos, what flavours you like? You like mangoes. Oh my god, lucky, you're so much smaller than these guys! What the hell? You're tiny! I only just noticed that. Alright, we'll go away, we'll get some poppins, we'll come back. Um, I'll double check all of the dinos here in case any of them happen to be rare, I guess. Uh, so let's have a look. We've got what? Dilophosaurus. Do do do. No, you're all common Dilophosaurus skins. That, those are common Allosaurus skins. Oh, Maria's here. Hi there. Hey! Hello, Izzy. I'd wave to you. I think my hand's gonna fall off. Can you writing hurts? Owen must have his hands of steel to keep all those notebooks of his. Rare dinosaur species? Good question. This is something I'd ask Owen. He's always taking note of the little details. Don't tell him I said that, though. The Stormy Gallimimus. Reports of sightings of a rare one, deep purple, roaming the valley during a rainstorm. Like juicy goodies, okay. Stormy's not the only one though, I've seen albino, melanistic and all sorts of others. Come to my ranch, wanna see a rare colour? Oh! Do I not have to... Do I not have to actually befriend a new one? Oh, you've got something else. Hi! People can be real jokesters. I heard you found some Parasolophus out in Ariacotta. I did! Dippity, what are we doing standing around here for? We've got Parasolophuses to track. Lucky is wonderful, but seeing a whole herd. I gotta go right now. I was about to eat, there's no time. You better have this. Marie Toast. Amazing. Thank you for your Marie Toast, Marie. Oh, also Lucky's here. I hadn't even sort of twigged that. Come on then, pet, let's get you home. Let's double check on the Uteraptors. I've seen that colour so much that can't be rare. Um, the Postosuchuses? Fairly confident that's a common Postosuchus colour. I mean, yep, that is the commonest Postosuchus colour. Boop. Uh, have a quick think, where are there other dinos? That's a common dimensional colour, I've seen that loads and loads of times. There's two Uteraptor who hang around in the actual village. I'll go have a look at those. Noon time. So I don't want to do the quest too early, you know, I, I want to I wanna do it properly. Like. Right, Uteraptor. This is Sand and Tangerine. They're both uncommon. Hi, Zara! I did the thing! 
I saw them! They found their way home! You did it! You and Lucky Beck in the back! I'm beyond proud! Thanks! You only helped put driving to my discoveries. You inspired me to chase my own passions! You proved the history is vital to help us move forward! We would never have found the parasaur offices without those tablets! And your flute! Everything is interconnected, and I know there are so many other discoveries. The candy holds many secrets, and I'm determined to find them all! Show us my favourite cake! Zara Mango Cake. Oh, thanks for your Zara Mango Cake. Okay, where else are there dinos? Uh, let's actually... Can I set day length? I'm sure someone said... Yeah, day length. Relaxed. Okay. Now that we have officially finished the game, I'm happy being a little more chill. I'm guessing that's a common T-Rex colour. That is... Cherry colour tiger pattern. That is another common pattern. That's fine. Uh, there's an Allosaurus up this way as well. We should check out. Hi, no, that's a common Allosaurus pattern. That's fine. Actually, is that cherry? I think that is cherry. I think that's orchid colour tiger pattern. Which is uncommon. Yeah, we're just going to go on kind of a tour of all the different dino sites, see if we can find a rare one. Um. This is sloth colour triceratops. Okay, we've got some Demetrodons and some thingy bollies. Here, I'm guessing these are common Demetrodon colours. Um, and then the others are Scalidosaurus. We have some light blues, which are bright sky. We have emeralds is the green ones, and wisteria is the pink ones. Those are all quite common. Oh, apparently albino ones of these guys are, are like still very pink. Which I wouldn't have guessed. Oh, hello, you're a pretty triceratops that I didn't see before. What colour are you with those pretty horns? This is a Proud Twilight, which is a rare Triceratops colour. Okay, what do Triceratops like? Triceratops like crunchy poppins. Let's go grab ourselves a Triceratops friend, shall we? Uh, what don't we need? Most of this. Oh, I forgot to sell my stuff. That's fine. I'll sell it tomorrow. Uh, okay. Um. Where's, where's food? There's food. Okay, stuff that's crunchy. You're non-crunchy. Are you crunchy? No. What's crunchy? A hazelnut's crunchy. They're crunchy. Is there anything I have more of that could be crunchy? No, I think hazelnuts might be my best bet for crunchy. Okay. Um. And then I need pop it. Actually, are you crunchy or potatoes are crunchy? Well, we'll use potatoes instead. Ah, uh, I need pop -ins. Crunchy poppins, and we think. Oh, we need, I need something that's juicy as well. Are you juicy? 
Clover's juicy. Okay, there we go. Right, that hopefully should be enough to to tempt in a Parasaurolophus. I think. And we'll get that Triceratops. I have no idea where we'll put the Triceratops, but we'll get the Triceratops. <laughs> You with the pretty horns. Hi there. Alright, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Uh, is there anyone in chat who would love to have a dinosaur named after them? Because if so, now is an excellent time to speak. Uh, and, and say your part. Right, you like potatoes. So have a potato. Have a soothe again. Have another potato. Crunchy puppet. Oh yeah. The Triceratops trusts you. Alright, if no one speaks now, then I know Shaka has been desperate to have a dino named after them. So if no one speaks up, this is gonna go to Shaka. Uh say hi. Pat pat. Alright, you got you got until I finish typing. <laughs> Shaka definitely needs a dino, says Arthur. Yeah, great. Well, okay, any last takers? Any last takers? Nope. Good. Right. Fantastic. We have a Shaka. A rare Shaka. With all of the pretty colours and... Oh, have we lost Lucky? No, we haven't lost Lucky. Thank goodness for that. Okay. Uh, let's go see if we can grab that parasol as well. Because apparently I need I need one for the quest. I think I might be able to make like a whole new pen. Um because I think if I take Lucky out of Lucky's current pen or someone out of Lucky's current pen, then there'll be a pen of three and with the two new dinos there'll be another pen of three. Is still here. Hi there! Right, they're over here. Hey guys! Alright. Uh, I guess I'll grab the purple one if it's the first one I spoke to? Nope, hello! I've got the wrong one, I think. I can't tell. No, I haven't. Okay. Hello! Hi friend! Parasolophus is curious about you. Alright, you like juicy things, right? Oh, no you don't like juicy things. Interesting. Um, do you like crunchy things? <laughs> crunchy is good. Amazing, you love crunchy things. Okay, well it's good that we, uh, it's good that we worked that out. Otherwise we would have wasted some poppins. Also, if anybody wants to be this Parasaurolophus, you also need to speak up now. Uh, 
Okay, right, have another potato. It's good we've got lots of potatoes, really. Look, I love everyone standing around to have a look while we while we make friends. Again, one more time. Otherwise, uh, I know Graham was here earlier. I'm sure we could we could stand to, to name a Dino Graham. Oh, we've gone too far this time. All right, we'll give it a try. I don't know what the chance is in the in this green area. It's not a guarantee. Ah, the parasol of us trusts you! Hooray! You're so huge, my goodness! Alright, last call for anyone. Otherwise, uh, who else is around? Graham is around, was lurking. King Girl was around earlier. I don't think King Girl has one either. Um, I feel like you can rename them, but I can't quite remember how. Uh Yes. You can rename them from your journal, apparently. Alright, for now, you will just be take two. Um Wonderful. Yes, that's the quest. That was the quest, right? Yeah, befriend a new Parasolophus, pal. Uh, maybe we have to bring you home? Oh, I'm worried I might not have enough fence posts to make the thing. Is, is Marlow still around? Still trading in Pebble Plaza. That's good. Okay. Hey, guys! Hey, Marie! Oh, all of those bushes grew back. Ah, that's handy. I guess that's a renewable source of fibre if I ever need one. Oh boy, I'm glad I set the day length to be long. <laughs> For this. Otherwise we would not be ready in time. I'm loosely worried as well that I might not have... There's Artie. Hi Artie! We're going home, Artie. Come follow us. I know I can't have you in my party, but follow us. <laughs> Sleeping dinosaurs scattered across the landscape. Oh, look! Hey, guys! This is Shaka, my new rare dino colour with the, the pretty horns. Disney, I knew you could do it. I had to follow you to see for myself. I was certain you would succeed. I was watching from the sidelines and you were brilliant. Wait, you were watching? <laughs> <laughs> what a marvellous dinosaur. I oh, think you a gorgeous critter. You are so cute. That You hear that, Chaka? Everyone thinks you're cute. You think the stomach size could be influenced by the colour variation. Why would you think that? <laughs> Why would you ask that question? <laughs> What about blending in? Do you think the colour affects socialisation? <laughs> of course, an excellent hypothesis. We should definitely include a chapter on this in the book. I thought you didn't want to write a book with me anymore. I would be remiss not to take advantage of your excellent tracking skills. Aw, I hear you've been brushing up on your tracking. You don't really need me anymore. <laughs> That's not true, Marie. Tracking is really hard, and you have great intuition. And you pick up on details, Alanis, and I keep forgetting to take notes. Yeah. Well, should you ever need a field partner, I'd be honoured by the company. I was actually going to ask to borrow some books. You have someone heard dinosaurs, right? Do I ever? You could come over now if you'd like. Yeah, I would like that. Oh yeah, we got the, the couple back together. Truly rocking Dino Dizzy, thanks for the chance to see one. Must be hungry, have this. 
<laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> oh, she's given us carnivore and herbivore food. It's just on the off chance that Shaka is like the the one carnivorous triceratops. <laughs> Although actually, there's a, a fun bit of paleo art about um, scavenging triceratops that I should show you guys. Absolutely superb. And yes, perhaps these treats would help. Oh yeah. See you around. Don't be a stranger. Bye! Heck yeah! You did a good job! Well done, Shaka. Now, let's see if we can make you somewhere to live. Um... Oh, I forgot to, to, to go and buy stuff from Marlo, so let's just hope we have enough to make a pen. Ah, ba 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 Storage. All this stuff we don't need. Burp. Oh, I just put my turnips away. Oh no. Where did they go? That'll do. That'll do fine. Um, there's a fair amount of herbivores that I hear about being opportunistic, opportunistic predators or scavengers, anecdotally at least. Yes! That's why I've, it's so interesting to me. Um, do, 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 right, okay, got to think, and dino care, okay, we have some things. We also have wooden fence, as opposed to wooden rope fence, which might be good enough, if we're lucky. We do luckily also have one trough, uh, and I'll need some dreamstones, fantastic. Uh, okie doke. So yeah, the plan is that the, the new pen is going to go here, around the apple tree. Uh, based on the fact that I think that's the most easy place to put a new pen. Probably. Just too far. Okay. And then let's uh, think about putting a gate on. We have a couple of gates. So if I'm lucky. to have worked alright. This is 52 meters squared, which I'm hoping is going to be enough. You need 50. You need 50. Okay, let's, let's say this is going to be enough. Uh, let's put in a trough. Only a small trough, because that's the only trough we have. Uh, actually, let's put it right next to the entrance here. Do I think I can squeeze through there? I can squeeze through there, that's fantastic. Food in the trough. Uh, I want some dreamstones, so let's grab that one as well. You can sleep there, and then I guess we'll need to sleep in this corner. Fantastic. All right. Uh, you. Hi. Uh, this is your home. Uh, I don't know where Thief has gone. I don't know where Shaka has gone, but uh, Hageshi. Hi. This is your home. Uh, Shaka? Where's Shaka gone? Oh, there you are. Hey, Shaka! Come here! Come here, pet! <laughs> Amazing. Shaka has a new home. Right. 
Uh... Yeah, there's apparently Higeshi's pen. Has pen, has live stream, so has thing. Okay, I think everyone is happy. I will double check. Three is enough. Um, for a herd dinosaur. Perceptops is a pack dinosaur, but that should be fine. I think. I think three is where a pack and a herd can coexist. Um... <laughs> Seems happy hearing that in the middle of the lecture. Oh dear. Um, so pack needs two to three. Herd needs lots. Um, uh, herd needs at least three. Okay, wonderful. So so three is like the best number to have, pretty much. Uh, wonderful. We all got homes. Uh, you are all valley dinos, I think? I might want to rearrange you slightly if one of you's not. Triceratops, you're a valley. Parasolophus, you're a valley. And Staraxaurus, you're a valley as well. Okay, that's fantastic. So, to upgrade these to valley patches, I need wood, fiber, dandelion, clothes. So let's go do that. Oh, hi Stereochromus. You you outside. This is Stereochromus, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's not just some random dinosaur that's wandered in. Wood, fiber, dandelion, clover. Put all the other stuff away, we don't need it. Uh wood, fiber. Dandelion. Oh. Amazing. Come on, Lucky. Let's build a home for our new friends. Hey, guys! Uh, wood. Clover. Dandelion. Fiber. Build. Get along. Wood, fiber, dandelion, clover. There we go! Large Valley Sleeping Patch built. Right, the other thing we need to do is friend call these two. No, hang on, so it's three, two, four, two, four, one, two, four. Amazing. No? You don't care? Oh. Did I do it wrong? Nope. But you don't care. Nope, okay. Shaka, hi. There we go. You cared. Try one more time. There we go! Okay, yeah, doing that once every day helps. Give you a pat in case I haven't already given you a pat today. Oh my god, I am starving hungry. <laughs> I might, I'm, it might be time for me to call stream just because I've just suddenly noticed how hungry I am. Uh, other than that, everyone seems to be doing pretty good right now. And in terms of quests, we don't really have many more. We need to befriend a new pal, 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 pal and bring a pie to Owen. I have no idea how to even make a pie. Um, because it hasn't given me the recipe. And I, I can't start making pie until I've learnt how to make at least one pie. <laughs> I can Google how to get the recipe for pie. But that might be... Cause that, that might be a thing for next stream. Or this could be the last Paleo Pine stream. I don't know. Um, like, we're nearly at the end of the year. Oh, 
asked. Somebody on Steam has asked how to unlock fights. Apparently we get one on our budding day from Freya. Um, when is my budding day? I don't. I don't know how to find out when my budding day is. Oh, actually, budding day is when you move in, right? So that'll be the the start of the new year. All right. Okay. Well, we'll we'll have one more Paleo Pine stream, I think. See if we can get like lemons and stuff to make a pie. If not, uh, who knows? But that is going to be it for me for today, at least. So let's drop a save. Uh, and let's head back to the menu, and I will go and find someone for us to raid because you shouldn't be going anywhere just yet okay no no gun jumping <laughs> uh let us see who is live who have we got uh dr simon clark is doing the new warhammer power wash sim levels i do love a bit of power wash and i do love a bit of warhammer brian he is also doing the new power shells shall we go say hi to dr simon clark i don't think i've ever raided dr simon clark before um he has a PhD, you know. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Simon Clark. There we go. Uh, alright. You know the drill of the raids. You're all lovely beans. Uh, Dr. Simon Clark is a lovely, wonderful human being as well. Uh, let's put you on a, on a BRX screen. Uh, be good. Make sure that he is just as proud to have him in his chat as I am to have you guys in mine. Uh, as I said before, I don't know when I'm going to be back. I, I I don't want to be missing streams, I'm just super duper not up to them. But it's been lovely being here and having you guys and having some kind of nice chill time. So maybe that will help them happen more in the future, you never know. Uh, thank you everyone so much if you stopped by. Uh, I know lots of people had to dip before the end. Uh, but you're all appreciated, you're all wonderful. Those who speak up in chat, but also those who luck and do other things, uh, those who spend time here when they can. Uh, my name has been Dizzy. If you miss me, uh, go check out my YouTube channel, it's down in the comments. I will be slowly uploading the last few VODs that I'm behind on, but slowly. Uh, <laughs> so, so pay attention, look out for those as they come. Uh, you can also find me on Twitter at this for Demise, on Mastodon at Eldritch.cafe slash this for Demise. Uh, both those places will get as many updates as my Discord. We can type exclamation mark Discord to find out in the chat. Go have a lovely raid, have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you hopefully next week. To everyone, bye!